Well, designer Nikki O'Neill is ready to up the ante in our contractor versus designer bathroom refresh challenge. Take a look. This is a small bathroom. Uh, one thing that is always an issue with any small space is storage. So I'm noticing here that you have this cabinet here. Yeah, so I got this cabinet to replace a shelf, but the shelf wasn't really practical. But I just keep my hair stuff, like my perfume and a little bit of makeup. And it does its job, but then there's still other elements I wish I could store like nightly under the, the sink. And then even in the bathtub, I don't have a proper space to put my shampoo and my soaps. It's just really frustrating. So I would like that to be nightly stored and kept. Understandable, you don't want to be shampooing the bottom of your tub, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now this here, what is going on with the towel rack? Did you put that up there? I did not put that up there. I don't know who thought it was a good idea, but I guess the contractors felt that that's where the towel rack should go. Okay. So that's where the towel rack is. So that is not going to be there anymore. That's going. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I noticed that when I open the door here, the t the rug moves. Mm -hmm. So I'm guessing this is probably an issue here. Yeah, my biggest pet peeve, because when I step out of the tub, I have to do a lunge to get onto the, the carpet so I'm not wetting up the floor. And then when I want to close the bathroom door, I got to move the carpet. It just is not really convenient. It's just such a nuisance. So there's a lot of things we have to work with here, but it can definitely be done. I'm happy. <laughs> One of the challenges with Shakira's bathroom was really trying to decide what her design style was. She liked both the Moroccan and the beachy. And this is how I was able to do that. This wallpaper is bold and beautiful. It, it's kind of this modern take on the Moroccan. And then I was able to incorporate and pull in the beachy elements with this beautiful shower curtain that has this big, bold leaf pattern. It's one of the first things you see when you walk into the room. And between those two, we were really able to decide what the color palette was for the entire space. And I pulled that through with the vanity, which I painted a deep, vibrant blue. Shakira really needed storage because what she had before was not working for her. So what I've added was the shelf and a basket to store her supplies and her toiletries. So I've also added this shelf. If you remember what she had before, it was kind of big and cumbersome. And this is light and airy, and it has the same amount of surface area as the other one did. We've also moved that obnoxious towel rack to the other side of the bathroom. And she also wanted to be a little bit more organized in the tub, so we've added a caddy. Originally, the bath mat was so big, you couldn't open and close the door without folding it. The solution, a smaller bath mat. It's right where it needs to be, and it's the perfect color for the room. What do you think? I love it. I love it all. I love this wall entirely so much. What's your favorite part about the room? My favorite part though is the mirror. I love the way you've incorporated something that I had and just transform it way beyond my own imagination. I was actually thinking I had to get rid of the mirror because I couldn't figure out what to do. <laughs> oh no, it's beautiful. I love that mirror. Totally I love it too. part of the room, yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm so glad that you <laughs> made it.